All right, I'm on hole number two of the Americana Classic. I'm in the weekend round of the Ricky Division. Hole number two. Okay, I'm using a Saturn and a Katana. Saturn and a Katana. Here we go. Saturn and a Katana. If you're watching these, I always go to Golf Clash Notebook. Whether I'm, anytime I'm doing tournament stuff, I always go to Golf Clash Notebook and look at the hole. I mean, a lot of times when I'm, when I'm shooting the video a lot, I'll stop and we'll draw on the screen or I'll do something and we'll talk about like different landing areas or like, you know, if you're laying up out here, what it looks like. But me personally, when I'm, when I'm playing, if I, I always go look at the hole before I do the thing, just so that it reminds me that, hey, okay, this is, this is what the hole looks like. And I start to gear up for it just to get myself prepared for that hole. See how our opponent does. They hit a great to the left. One ring. And here, if you hit a great to the right, you might get lucky because it's engaging that hill more. And you could, you know, so if you're going to hit it great one way or the other here, great to the right is better. So I'm going to wedge my blue rings up. So I'm right in that spot. I'm going to do six backspin. Three, four, five, six, and just a little smidget of left hand side spin. And it is 1.9 per ring, so it's slightly over a ring. And then just try and hit it perfect. Isn't it perfect? A little short and a little low. I'll continue to work that hole. That I'll tell you this this hole right here. You look at it and you go, man, this is a great hole in one shot. This hole is inconsistent. If you can, it's one of those things that don't be afraid to, because I seem like I'm always close on that hole, and I do get hole in ones. I've gotten hole in ones on this hole, but it's you know it's just like any other par three. I mean, you occasionally get a hole in one on it. But you're always close. Problem is, is I'm still trying to do an old setup on a newly designed hole and expecting a similar result as the old setup. I'm having to adjust it different, but still need to work on that hole. That's what that's what these scores why these scores are so crazy because whoever shot the 35 got three got five hole in ones or got some albies in there but they got some hole in ones and there's one of the holes in this tournament that's very hole in oneable seven but the other two are um, you know you got to work for it all right that was hole number two of the Americana Classic in the weekend round of the Ricky Division thanks for watching.